Hello, this is Teja Gürken, one of the senior editors at Acoustic Guitar. Today I'm here with the Breedlove C25 SME, which is part of the company's new American series. Breedlove Guitars was founded in 1990, and while they're primarily known for their high-end custom instruments, the company offers a diverse range of guitars that starts with the entry-level Atlas series, which is made in Korea. Introduced in early 2010, Breedlove's American series represents an effort to offer an incredible value in a line of guitars that is built completely in the company's own shop in Bend, Oregon. With prices that start at around $1,000, the American series encompasses several models with various body sizes and feature sets. The C25 SME that I'm holding here adds a cutaway and built-in electronics to the most basic American series model and has a street price of about $1,500. The concert size guitar has a solid Sitka spruce top, solid mahogany back and sides, a mahogany neck that is bolted to the body, and a rosewood fingerboard and bridge. The bridge is a pinless design, which means that rather than being secured with bridge pins, the strings simply get fed through a set of holes in the back of the bridge, similar to a classical guitar. Inside, the guitar has scalloped X bracing, and like many breed loves, it includes a special bridge truss system that connects the bottom of the bridge with the guitar's end block through a wooden dowel, which relieves tension from the top. Since this system is inside the guitar, you can't see it here, but you can go to breedloveguitars.com for a full description. The neck on the C25 SME has a width of 1 and 3 quarter inches at the nut and a 25 and a half inch scale. The string spacing at the saddle is 2 and 1 quarter inches. The guitar has Goto 381 tuning machines. Here is how the guitar sounds played acoustically, played finger style. I've got the guitar tuned to dadgad tuning, and you can tell that the open strings add a really nice sustain while the fretted strings offer great balance, so the overall sound uh, has a very even quality. So that's what the guitar sounded like played finger style. Here's how the guitar sounds when I strum it with a pick. Again, you can tell that the guitar has a great balance, and uh, even though it's got a small body, um, the guitar puts out a nice full sound. But the Breedlove C25 SME isn't limited to acoustic playing. The guitar includes an LR Bags Element Electronic System, which consists of an under saddle pickup, an internal preamp that runs on a 9 volt battery, and a control unit for adjusting volume and tone mounted at the edge of the sound hole right here. Let's listen to how the guitar sounds plugged into this Fishman Loudbox 100 amplifier. So you can tell that even though the element pickup system is a very basic system that only relies on one under saddle pickup, uh, it manages to represent the guitar's acoustic tone pretty well, even played through an amplifier. So that's the Breedlove C25 SME. It's a cool guitar that's easy and fun to play, and that would work well in a variety of styles. For the full review, please check out AcousticGuitar.com or the February 2011 issue of Acoustic Guitar Magazine. For Acoustic Guitar, I'm Taya Gurken.